Hello. You have been favored by God, the angel told Mary. God is with you. Mary was shaken, wondering what a greeting like that was supposed to mean. The angel explained, Do not be afraid. Do not be afraid. You have found favor in God's eyes. You are going to be pregnant and give birth to a son. Whose name will be Jesus. He will be great and be called Son of the Highest. His reign will never cease. The Holy Spirit will come upon you. The power of the Highest hover over you. Therefore, the child you bring to birth will be called Holy, Son of God. Because nothing is impossible with God. Mary answered him, I am the Lord's and ready to serve him. His mercy endures forever. It is for all mankind. It was at this time that Caesar Augustus ordered a census to be taken. A census like that had never happened before. Everyone had to travel to his own hometown to be accounted for. Joseph had to travel to Bethlehem for the census. He went with Mary, his fiancée, who was pregnant. When they arrived in Bethlehem, it was time for Mary to give birth. She gave birth to her firstborn, a son. She wrapped him in a blanket and laid him in a manger. Because there was no room for them in the hostel. That night, there were shepherds watching their flock outside the town of Bethlehem. An angel of the Lord appeared in their midst. The shepherds were terrified. But the angel calmed them and said, Don't be afraid. I'm here to bring good news about a joyful event that is for all of humanity. The Savior has been born in Bethlehem, the city of David. He is Christ, the Lord. You will recognize him. He is wrapped in a blanket, lying in a manger. Will you recognize him? Suddenly, they were surrounded by countless angels who praised God. Glory to God in the heavenly heights. He brings peace to the world. He turns to humanity in love. Several wise men came to Jerusalem from a country in the east. They had seen his star rise in the sky. The same star they had been following led them now too. It led them now too. The star hovered over the house in which the child was sleeping. When they saw it, they were full of joy. They entered the house and found the child and Mary, his mother. 
they fell to their knees and praised the child like a king. They opened their luggage and presented the child with gold, frankincense and myrrh. I, Jesus, have sent my angels to you so you would declare far and wide, I am the bright morning star. Come. Whoever is thirsty, come, everyone. Everyone who thirsts for it. God will give you water of life. 